Hi, I'm Crystal and I'm from the class of 2021. I'm a woman in gender studies major here at Wheaton. And I'm from the class of 2022 and I'm majoring in psychology. Hi, I'm Stephanie. I am not a student at Wheaton, but I'm the lead recruiter for Wheaton uh, for a semester in the city. And we're here to talk to you about a special program offered to Wheaton students, spoiler, spoiler alert, called Semester in the City, which gives you the opportunity to earn a four Wheaton, four Wheaton credits while gaining a real world experience and learning how to make change. Semester in the City is a 15 week program. You can go either in the fall or spring and you get a full semester's worth of credits and it's open to all majors. You spend 30 hours a week at an internship Monday through th Thursday for the social sector organization, mostly nonprofits, but also social mission businesses, government agencies in the Boston area. I was a part of the fall of 2018 cohort of Semester in the City. I was matched with a nonprofit in Boston called Friends of the Hernandez after school program. I was a social media intern and I worked with creating weekly posts for the program on Instagram, Facebook, and Twitter. I also got the opportunity to teach photography to the students in the program. My special project was a style guide that was used by other interns who attended Semester in the City after me. My mentor was named Amy Balness and she worked on professional development and networking. She taught me um, how to basically have an internship because it was my first internship experience. Now I'm going to hand it over to Meg and have her tell you more about Semester in the City and her experience with it. So on top of the internship, you also take a Wednesday evening course and a Friday workshop that are hands-on, interactive, and teach real-world problems problem solving skills. You also pay your same Wheaton tuition, all financial aid and scholarships apply, meaning it doesn't cost any more than a semester on campus. You will live in apartments in Alston, Mass, near the BU area with other students who are doing the program, and the apartments are cheaper than living on campus at Wheaton. While I was that semester in the city, I was part of this fall 2019 cohort. I was matched with Playworks, which is a nonprofit organization that focuses on the social and emotional well being of students at recess and how to facilitate a positive environment. I also did a special project that involved paraprofessionals at the school I was placed um, in creating their recess facilitation schedule, and I used student led surveys to get their feedback as well. I had a mentor named Carly Jeremiah, who was the recess coach at that school, and she gave me a lot of advice on how to be a great mentor to kids. Awesome. Thank you, Megan Crystal. And as I said, I work for Semester in the City as the lead recruiter for Wheaton. And Meg and Crystal represent just two of the many majors we've had represented in Semester in the City and from Wheaton. Um, some details on how to apply. It only takes about 25 to 30 minutes to submit your application for Semester in the City. No need to worry about long essays or a stressful application process. Really, we're just looking to get to know you. And the sooner you apply, the sooner you can make your plans. We're processing applications immediately, so don't hesitate to apply. However, our deadlines, FYI, for spring 2021 are October 1st for priority um, application if you want to be considered for priority matching and the final deadline, which is November 1st. I have here our uh, website and the link to apply and our campus liaison. If you have any questions on the Wheaton side of things is Delita Cathcart. Um, and of course me, please feel free to reach out to Crystal or Meg or I, if you have any questions or want to chat, we're definitely here for you uh, to do that. Um, we're excited to work with you and to decide um, if this is the right opportunity for you. Definitely, if you're interested in learning more, feel free to scan this QR code, which puts you into our database and um, help, helps us know who you are and that you're interested in applying so we can reach out by email and keep you updated via email on any deadlines. And a QR code to apply is also on this screen. And um, the best way that we think you um, are going to really get a sense of what semester in the city is like is coming to the virtual open house, which is Friday, October 2nd. It's going to give you a really great idea of what the program is like uh, by talking directly to fellows participating right now. You'll learn more about their internship placements, hear what it's like to live in the city, and have the option to do a virtual tour of the apartments. Um, so here's a QR code for that and a bit.ly link as well uh, to register early. 
and uh, other ways to learn more. We have upcoming info sessions that are customized to your major and interests. So definitely feel free to check out our website for all of that information that lives there. Um, we have an info session cal calendar as well. Other than that, hope that was a good synopsis of what Semester in the City is all about and hope you're interested in applying. Um, we're excited to learn more about you. Thank you all so much for listening. Um, Meg and Crystal, any last minute thoughts or advice for anyone listening and thinking about applying to Semester in the City or learning more? Yeah, just feel free to reach out to us if you want um, the student perspective on the program. We'd be happy to answer any of your questions. Awesome. Agreed. Thank you all so much. Bye.